for melee. You know, yeah. we saw we saw Leppen whoop Wizrope. We saw Wizrope whoop Swedish Delight. We oh saw yeah. Swedish Delight whoop Professor Pro. So it, like, there's so many levels just in the spots from second to fifth place at the tournament. Mm. Ridiculous. Yeah, it is pretty crazy. Okay, and then we have Armada waiting in, win uh, in grand finals from yeah, winner's yeah. side, transcending all these people. God Slayers and Demi Gods and mere mortals alike. Yes, yeah, whatever you want to call them, Armada will kill them. <laughs> Definitely, yeah. Okay, good defensive options there from Wizrobe using the Nair and the back air to zone. Oh, and then sends left and off stage. Ooh, Ooh very late up aerial there, getting left, uh, keeping left and off stage, but he gets his rejump by yeah, making yeah. it to the ledge. Up there was truly spectacular, but Leffen still manages to get in. Leffen with a little flop there. Yeah, flubs the laser, does it on the ground. A lot of lag on that and gets punished yeah. pretty heavily. Don't you think it's crazy that the developers forgot to give the lag, like, when you, when you do it off jump? Yeah. What a crazy oversight. <laughs> and, and, and this makes Fox and Falco virtually the best characters in the game, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's just their lasers. Okie dokie, so Leffen gets the wave shine pressure going on here. Continues it after the tech roll away, really putting the beat down on Wizzy, but now he's hit his moment. Got a tech chase here. And this is where he really shines on the tech chases against space animals. Yeah, Leffen cleverly goes to the edge and uses that shine, making it much harder for Wizzy to find some sort of ledge guard. Ah, unfortunate. Yeah. Not getting the mid short in there. Yeah, he wanted a one half, he got a quarter. It's not quite enough. Uh huh. But, you know, that's the down to the wire kind of nature of melee. You have to be exactly right. Definitely. And yeah, Wizzy got caught off guard there, out of his rejump, trying to edge guard Leffen, but Leffen like retaliated with a back air on his own, and Wizzy had no ch chance to make it back to the stage and died quite early. Yeah. Caught out of the air with that neutral air. It's not the kind of thing that Leffen wants to be facing. Wizzy steals the ledge, forcing him to up B, and sets up a beautiful edge guard yep. there. Looking like none. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, he, he was still invincible. invincible. Yeah. Wow. Okay. That was a, that was yeah. a long two second dude. I think uh, Leffen's going to have to tighten up his um, movement from the ledge. A lot of time he's going for like a ledge dash into straight aerial, and the Wizrobe is looking for it and cutting it out in a big well, way. This could be the stock, potentially. Speaking of ledge play, this should be Leffen's opportunity. No, he's dropped it. That's not like him at all. Second chance, perhaps. And good shield DI inwards to Ooh. still get the punish out of it, and there we go. Last stock situation looking a lot closer than yeah. uh, than the beginning of the first set. They played in winner semis, but you know Leffen has all the momentum right now, and Ooh. he keeps all the momentum right now. Wizzy, yeah, he gets the first knockdown. This is a big oh. combo. Double back oh. air sends him off stage. Wizzy sneaks oh, the edge back and gets it. Oh, and Leffen messes no. up his tech, gets caught off guard by the knee. Yeah, oh moly, yeah. Wizro being able to sneak to the ledge there between those back airs was so key because he gets underneath Leffen, yep. scoops him up with an up air, and Leffen was not ready to be playing a defensive game, you know, misses that tech, suddenly is like, crap, ends up doing awful DI. Perhaps he was trying to wow. take it to the ground or something, but you know, really, really cost him there. And they go to Fountain of Dreams, mm. of course. Oh. Yeah, Leffen going for the back throw, forcing oh. the position. The up smash, the, the ending lag and the trajectory from the up smash was still enough so Leffen, after the lag of the up smash ended, could still get a get an up tilt in on Wizzy. That was amazing. Yeah. Yeah, these two players really, really big combos. Prop like these two players define the punish games of their characters in the meta game. Uh-huh. For sure. Ooh, Leffen with an amazing angle. With Rob not being able to edge guard there, but uh, Gets onto the stage a little bit sloppily. Uh, Wizard definitely picked up on the on the Leffen's getting up from the ledge patterns at yeah. this point. So it uh, makes it much more difficult for him. And uh, Wizard, after all, is in the lead. So maybe Leffen has to, uh, you know, think a little bit differently. Mm. Think a little bit outside of the box because Wizard definitely has picked up on Leffen's uh, apparent habits. Mm, you see that ledge dash getting called out again by Wizard. Uh huh. I think maybe some sort of a, a shallow ledge dash into the shield, something like that might be uh, what's needed for Leffen here. Yeah. Just, you know, mix it up, add some sort of guesswork to this rather than just, you know, getting caught out by that defensive, well placed back air. Ooh. Oh. Big knee, but gets to the edge. Oh, that was big. That's classic Wizzy roll. stuff. Catch uh -huh. the weak knee on the way down so that you can double jump up air them out of the RB. Send them to their death. Left them down here. Yeah. 
It's you know uh, when when Wizzy started turning up the Jets in the first set when uh, it looked like he actually had a shot at taking it. Yeah. I didn't have the feeling that uh, Leffen played any different from yes uh, he yeah. did before, but now it looks like Leffen does a, a little more mistakes than he did yeah. in the first set. Maybe he's running out of steam. Maybe that's what he was talking about on Twitter earlier today, that he, you know, he doesn't really feel it. And that said, Lamada must have taken a toll on his, oh on his yes, energy levels, certainly, you know? Most certainly. So potentially Leffen just, you know, a little bit low on energy right now, but nothing to that, that he couldn't overcome and that he didn't overcome Ooh. like earlier and in other instances. So mm. Wizrow has been relying on that Nair back into the stage to cover him a lot. And Leffen just says, I'm gonna F smash you and you're gonna die. He gets it. Yeah. For real there. But Winsrobe, similar edge guard again. And last stock here. Oh. Grab here, what can he get? That was definitely a missed input, that full hop there. Uh huh. Yeah, when, when Wizzy messes up his trade. Oh, oh no. Big up till there. Now Leffen is down 2 0 in this Yeah, set. I did not expect to see that, especially not after what we saw in the winner semifinals. But then again, we saw Wizzy waking up. Yeah. We, Wizzy had a longer way in, in losers bracket, so he, he played one more set. He got warmed up a little more. Yeah. Uh, and he didn't take six minutes between between uh, sets right here because he had to just stay there and sit down, you know? Yeah, I mean, one of the things that you're struggling with is the, you know, the mental game and the focus and all of these things. It, if you're having that problem at the start of the day, it's probably only going to get worse as you go through the day. If you play each grueling and difficult and trying set. Uh -huh. All right, we go right back to Fountain of Dreams. Leffen still believes that this is the strongest counter pick that he has yeah. against Falcon. I think I uh, I don't have too much to say against that. Yeah, yeah. Um, Leffen also he was he was looking poised to take the the that other game. You know, oh, here. it's gonna be the kill. Yeah. Oh no, it's not. He, he actually Ooh. saved him. Yeah, and then Wizzy managed to sneak out of that wave shine. Ooh, twice we see that from Wizzy, but yeah. it didn't knock uh, left him down there because he was on such low percent. So he exactly. still managed to get the kill. I think left tried to go for a shield drop back out there, but instead rolled, unfortunately. But he still got the got the kill in the end. Yeah. So uh, good stuff to, to him taking the lead in that third game. A really, really much needed lead, you know. I think Leffen could need some confidence right now because he's yes. down 2-0 against an opponent that he one hour ago whooped yes. big time for two games in a row. Yeah. And I can't help but feel like the longer the set's gone on, the more I'm starting to see the cracks in Leffen's gameplay. Yeah, exactly. You know, he's got a good start in this game, but if he gets if he eats one nasty combo from Wizrobe, I can definitely see him, you know, getting a little shaken up, getting a little down. And that's yeah. not the mentality you're gonna have if you get a go and face Armada in Grand Finals. Exactly. We see him flubbing things that we like that he usually yeah. grinded out. Like he he did several rolls on platforms, but he was clearly meant to you know uh, try to shield drop back air his opponent. Yeah, I've seen a missed uh, wave dash back out of shield as well. Yeah, it's like seeing a missed ledge things, dashes. Yeah, these are tournament that winners. doesn't you normally drop, you know. Yeah, exactly. I don't know. I don't know what it is because yeah. in the first set he didn't. But maybe, as we said, as we established earlier, maybe he's just running out of steam, which is uh, would be unfortunate. But uh, I think he's still got some fight left in him, and he is in the lead right now. You know, well, not anymore, but <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's the commentator's curse for you. Yes, it is, and that's just the nature of these games. You know, this, you can have a yeah. lead, but it can go in a split second. You can eat one. You can think, oh, I'm just taking place this one time, and then suddenly, boom, boom, that's two knees, and you are. <laughs> Oh, you are not All dead. dead, but <laughs> saved. Less there. Let's sort of let him sneak back to the ledge. Oh, Ooh. that was a very ballsy move choice by Wizrob. Not too sure if he actually meant to do that side Yeah, beat. I mean, I've seen him. We saw him against Trip, and it worked out for him. I think maybe he had a similar idea, but on this Yo, occasion, that, Leffen was wise. To that trip. angle was so smart by yes, Leffen, recognizing was, yeah. that Wizzy was a little bit too low for him to actually hit him if he if he goes for that specific angle and Leffen could you know choose after the fact that he saw Wizzy dipping a little bit too low so yeah good reaction time and very wise choice there by Leffen and also perfect execution those angles are not as easy as they may look because there's I think 352 possible angles you know put them in perfectly well every time is so difficult yes, yeah and it's something that um Leffen has is honestly one of the best players in the world at, you know, aside mm. from people who use, uh, you know, modern controllers where they, yep. where that's uh, possible. But Leffen has really, really grinded them out. And we see him do some pretty amazing stuff with his upbeat, honestly. Oh. 
eats the back air there, and this is like, Leopard's on his last life in this tournament. We need uh -huh. to emphasize that. This is a god and a non-god, and it looks like, you know, yeah. the god would, slayer is going to get slayed himself here, potentially. But I would say, I would say those two players are <laughs> that not knee, Is that going to oh. be it? It's got opportunity back uh, air. Oh, and he messes up. He yes, Leopard has, has one more chance. Yeah. Doesn't want to be jumping in like that. Forward air, weak knee. And that this is, is going it. to be it. Wizrobe 3 0. 3 0. 3 0 over Leopard. That is crazy. Wizrobe is feeling good right now. Oh, yeah. And now he has got another shot at Armada, who he came close to beating. Mm. So, so close to beating. Just two weeks ago at uh, the Smash Summit uh, 5. Yes. What's the fifth one uh, already, right? Yeah, I think so. Wow. Shoutouts to be on the summit. Yeah. These guys are amazing. Yeah. And yeah, uh, I was about to say, before we saw the very last situations of that of that set where uh, Wizard was able to beat Leffen, mm -hmm. even though Leffen considered like a god slayer or a god himself, yeah. and Rizwob isn't, I think these two players at the end of the year won't be more than what, like six ranks apart of each yeah, other, you know, from each other. definitely been on the up and up. Yeah. He's on the climb for I think, sure. Yeah, he's one of the one of, one of the most improved players of the year. Mm. Even though, like, I, I don't think he necessarily, like, jumped a lot of ranks, but yeah. you could see in his gameplay that he's coming so much closer to the very, very top of the play, uh, of top of the game. 